Well, good morning. Welcome, everyone. It is Saturday, nearing 2 p.m. here at the Atlanta Motor Speedway, and things are underway. The rain has moved on. The sun shines out for a high of, I think, 48 degrees here today for a double header. We're going to start off with the Truck Series race, and then we're going to do the uh, Xfinity race at 4 or 5 p.m. And then we already did qualifying, so I'm happy to report that Kevin Harvick, he came in at sixth for tomorrow's race. I'm gonna kind of bundle Saturday and Sunday and everything going on. Thanks for joining me, guys. I will be uploading this video with some Nomad Internet, link below in the video description. Let's get this day underway. That's right, everybody. Up here on the, the roof of my RV for an awesome view. Check out turn one right there going into turn two. It's an awesome view. Starting my afternoon off with a Berg. That's how we do that. I feel like I'm doing stuff right here, guys. It's gonna be the coldest race ever. Uh, 28 degrees overnight tonight. Yeah, yeah. Let me eat this, I'll talk to you. Oh, that was delicious. You'll also notice that uh, they made us take down all of our flags. Uh, anytime there's a race anywhere in the infield, you got to remove them. They cannot be any higher than the top roof of the RV, or I think 10 foot six or something like that. So we'll put the flags up after the race. We're going to start off with the truck series. Corey LaJoy is not going to be in his truck this week. He'll be tomorrow with Ty Dillon. By the way, it is set. So I said Har Harvick is going to start six tomorrow. Corey LaJoy and Ty Dillon are both going to be uh, a little bit farther down in the lineup, but that's okay. They get their crashes out of the way tomorrow, hopefully. Uh, this morning, before the sun even came up, we actually had all of the Cup Series haulers come through the tunnel, and it was so cool to be right here next to the tunnel to be able to see all the colorful semi trucks hauling all the race teams. And then when the Spire Motorsports Corey LaJoy truck, I love that black look. That is one slick looking truck looking awesome, getting all prepared. And then right behind Corey LaJoy's truck was, was Ty Dillon. Heck yeah. We've got at least three and a half hours of racing with the, with the two different races here on a mile and a half oval. And uh, once the cars get going for the first time since I've been here, uh, we'll be able to see the uh, turns three and four over there all the way across. It's really unique because we're up so high. Plus these banks were redone. They are Daytona degree banks here at Atlanta. It used to be much, much flatter and a lot more wrecks around the corners, but see how it goes. just didn't have room to come up in front of Tanner Gray, I believe. Not a big wreck, but that's the first accident caused by a yellow because there was a uh, one car that had a mechanical problem, one car, there were, one time there was debris. That's the first time there's actually been a spin out with damage. One car wreck. I think the trucks are doing pretty good for no practice, no qualifying. They're doing pretty good. About 40 laps to go in the race. Stuart Friesen has made a third line down. Oh, Probably trouble. not a smoker. The 51 Jack Wood goes around. I don't like that. I don't like that. Coming up from behind, bump and run the leader and crash him out into the wall. I don't like that, NASCAR. I, I know a lot of people say that's just racing, but you can't just bump and... <laughs> it's like it's like a pit maneuver just to take the just to steal the lead. I don't like it. I, I don't like it. Got a truck sideways right in the middle. Big guy that was Ben Rose. Yeah, big, big push that went wrong. But he was able to save it somehow. Somehow, and, and now he's going to get ahead of Nemechek. 
And caution is out for the 10th time. We do break the record. Now, officially, the most caution flags. Four to go. We have, get this, a record-breaking 10th caution flag here at the Craftsman Truck Series race. A record-breaking caution. A lot of people going to the wall. I don't know if they're not used to the bank, the high bank, or what's going on, but setting records here in 2023. We're gonna finish on that white, green, checkered flag thing eventually. It'll be a while though. All right, we're gonna go green. The lights on the pace truck are out. We're gonna do a NASCAR overtime, green, white, checkered. We gotta get one clean lap in, and then the next lap, whatever happens, wins. Oh, big wreck. Big wreck. I think Christian Eckes won though. Big wreck. That's it, it's over. Yep. Number 19, just one. Wow, what a finish. They gotta reset everything. We're gonna get ready for the Xfinity race starting right after this, as soon. I mean, I wish they would have like spaced everything out over the course of the weekend, but they didn't, they didn't. It's all happening today. It's over guys. Well, the first one's over. How'd you guys do? Man, we're pretty used to it. Yeah, but we don't like it, Dad. We, we want it to stop. Okay, well, it's gonna stop for 10 minutes, okay? You got a 10 minute break. My sweet babies, you do so good. You both do so good. I think it's so cute how they stay together during the race. They're doing okay. Don't worry about my kitties, they're just fine. They love it. They know they get special treats. They get treats? Do they get treats? Right now, treats? Treats, treats, treats? Oh yeah, yeah. Heck yeah, you get treats, because you're good, good kitties. Yeah, good kitties. Uh, before they start the next race, then go walk around. I want to find out and see if they're doing any kind of concessions or food. Like, you know, it's, it's a new race. I just don't know what's even going on. It rained so much. At the end of my last video, I didn't get to do anything. Let's go see. Let's go walk around a little bit. Yeah, so we're over here near row N. And I just want to point out that now we're so much lower that you cannot see any of the track here in this camping area. We really do have a really good spot there. Even down this way, near near the front stretch, you can't see any racing action down here if you're camping here. But, they've got a couple booths open here. They got the souvenirs. We'll check those out, see if we can get a magnet. And they've also got the infield grill going on today. All right, so real basic food here at the infield grill. They don't even have hamburgers, but they do have hot dogs. and delicious nachos. All right. All right. Oh my gosh, that was so much better than it should have been. I did get me an Atlanta Motor Speedway <laughs> magnet for the year. Heck yeah. Oh yeah, I'll be back to this nacho stand later. So I decided to come inside the RV and watch it on Fox Sports 1 here off my Dish Network, at least for the start of the race. Oh, I don't know if you can see, we are only 19 laps into 163 for context, and we are only two cautions away from again breaking another caution record for the Xfinity race. I don't know what it is about this track, but people cannot keep their cars straight. 19 laps and we've had five cautions already. Plus, I've got the heater on here inside the RV, the, the furnace going good. It's not hot Lana. It is not hot Lana. It is cold Atlanta. Oh my gosh, I just realized something. This is the first of two races in Atlanta. I was wrong when I said this, that tomorrow is Harvick's last Atlanta race. They race here in July, and that's where hot Lana gets its name because it's boiling hot. No, there is one more race here this year, this season. Okay. Anyway, I'll put my jacket on here in a little bit, head back up to the roof, probably catch the end of it. Because of all the cautions, I'm fairly sure we're going to finish under the... They're, they're literally going to have to turn the lights on. We are only 19 laps into this race, and it's already 6.20 p.m. Yeah, we're, they're going to turn the lights on. Back to green flag right now. We are going to another overtime for the Xfinity race. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, what a day, what a day. White flag, white flag. Daniel Hemrick shoving Austin Hill down oh, low. Oh no, oh, no. Sideways. can they hang on? Austin Hill wins once again. He goes oh back God. to back here at Atlanta.
Atlanta as they crash across the start finish line. I feel like he an to... incredible wreck at the finish line. Austin Hill got it. Holy cow! Woo! Woo Man, I'm glad I didn't give up on that race. What a good race. Let's, the kitties are fine, they've got heat in there. Let's head over to the bootleggers bar. It's supposed to be a concert here tonight. <sighs> a chilly, chilly, chilly night. All right, well, this is where the after party is, the Beach Pit at Atlanta Motor Speedway. And look, they even brought us out some heaters. <laughs> yeah, it's a cover band called Back in Black, and they're an ACDC cover band. This should be interesting, right? Look at this, guys. Because it's so cold, they brought in jet heaters. Literally blowing heat. Man, no. no. They love us. No. <laughs> Getting ready for some ACDC cover band.
they were so good. So good. Love ACDC. Now the long walk back to the RV. Oh, it's so cold. Is it freezing yet? I think it's freezing. I'm pretty sure it's freezing. Oh my God. Sweat. Sweat. I didn't have anybody to record my, I did some good Wheeler Walker Jr. Man, that was fun. That was fun. I ain't got no video evidence. Let's go back and see the kitties. Dang it. Dang it. Well, that sucks. My buddy Robert would have filmed it if he was here. What the? Oh, we're flashing. We're... Opie, we're flashing. He doesn't care. He just wants to cuddle. He's like, he's so cuddle deprived. He's like, please, dad, just cuddle me and stuff. Oh, I get kisses? You were kissing me. I get kisses. I get kisses. All right, guys, NASCAR race. I'll tune back in in the morning. All right. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Today's the big race, guys. Yep, one more race, and then I'm going to be all NASCAR'd out. <laughs> I am. Got one more race. Harvick, number four. Let's win one. All right. It's it's chilly. It's it's windy out here, but I'm gonna I'm gonna brave it for as long as I can. They just finished driver introductions. We're getting ready to roll here for the Ambetter 250 here in Atlanta. One of two races here at Atlanta. So go Harvick, go LaJoy, and go Ty Dillon. Got three to root for. Here's our view. We'll see. I did get an offer to go to the other corner, uh, turn four over there with some friends later. We may even head over there, but we're going to start the race right here at my spot. Yeah. finished uh, stage one here and as you can see I'm in a totally new spot here over uh, turn four got tater tot over here my friends uh, Seth and Robbie got this schoolie right here with a ladder they invited me up here they're they're cooking and it's a it's a cool looking rig up there with a good view let's go check it out let's hop up to the top of the the bussy here the bus platform oh yeah this is a really good view Look at this, We've got turn four right here, going into the pits. The pits are right here. Totally different up here, wow. There's turn three coming into four. Look at this, there's so many cool spots. I like it. And no need for a trash can, they have a beer chute right there. Noink. Awesome. What do we got here? Oh, the pulled pork there. Oh my gosh. More pulled pork. Wow. Tim Fito, a little. Whoa! Whoa. Turn he got turned by Chastain and around they go. Good break. Kyle Bush is around. Josh Berry, oh, Busher into the wall. Josh Berry, a lot of damage on the front of the nine. That's all it took. Well, 
it's over. Not the outcome I was hoping for. Joey Logano, the pole sitter, won the race. Harvick crashed after I, that clip I showed you. But however, however, Corey LaJoy, number seven, finished a season best fourth place. Way to go, Corey. Opie's dopies, I came back to see you, my big boy. What a good boy. Terrible bear, uh, my baby girl, it's over. It's all over now, okay? All right, well, she... I gotta pack her up, guys. I'm just gonna take it easy tonight. Pack her up, leave first thing in the morning. I got most of everything put away. A couple of signs, all my flags, everything else is put away. Hook her up in the morning and uh, head out of here. I need a break. I need a quiet break in the mountains. The Georgia mountains, maybe? North Carolina, or South Carolina mountains, maybe? I don't know. Oh, now they've got two exits and one entrance. That makes sense, because a lot of people are leaving. I mean, a lot of people are leaving tonight. Anyways, guys, good race. Awesome. That was fun. Atlanta Motor Speedway, pretty cool. Pretty cool. You guys be well. Opie and Tara and I will see you, I think, from a new state in our next video. Okay? All right. Bye, guys. Whoop.